Hi everyone, hope you all are doing great. Tassin here. Today I'm here to discuss about verbs and kinds of verbs. So, what is mean by verb? Verb is nothing but action. Eating, sleeping, running, jumping. This all action comes under verb. So, while discussing parts of speech, I told you something. Uh, state of being. What is state of being? For example, there is a sentence, I am a doctor. So here am is state of being. So let's discuss what is that am. That am is also a verb. So how it is a verb and what are the kinds of verb. So let me tell you there are two kinds of verb. One is main verb, another is auxiliary verb. So two verbs are there, actually two kinds are there. One is main verb, the other one is auxiliary verb. So what does mean by main verb? Main verb will give meaning by itself. But auxiliary verb will depend on main verb to give meaning for example i fish swim fish swim so it swim here is main verb so it gives meaning by itself for example if i tell you my uncle will bring mangoes my uncle will bring mangoes in the sentence my uncle will bring here bring is main verb will is helping verb so what i told you is main verb will give meaning by itself my uncle will bring without will also my uncle bring it is understood my uncle is going to bring something for me so without helping verb then also main verb will give meaning but my uncle will my uncle will will does it give any meaning no it needs help main verbs so that aux auxiliary verb is depend on main verb so let me explain you with few examples so that you can have a very clear idea what is mean by main verb and auxiliary verb so here we can see there are two kinds of verbs main verb and auxiliary verb so main verb are those which gives meaning by themselves for example if you see birds fly birds fly fly here is main verb it will give meaning by itself fish swim here swim is verb action so it gives meaning by itself here they jump so jump in the sense it is understood it's a main verb that it gives meaning by itself so when I explain you about auxiliary verb, you will be very clear about actually how to differentiate main verb and auxiliary verb. So auxiliary verb are only helping verbs. They depend on main verbs. So let me, uh, let me explain you. I am eating a mango. So here eating is an action. So what is that actually? It is main verb. What is I am here? It is a helping verb. It is not a main verb. For example, if I tell you, I eating a mango, I eating a mango, it gives a meaning. Yes, it gives meaning. It doesn't want any helping verb. But here, am, I am, I am, I am, I am, does it give any meaning? No, it needs the main verb. I am eating. So then it gives a meaning. So here in the next sentence, my uncle will bring sweets. My uncle will bring sweets here bring is verb here will is helping verb here actually hope you can see my uncle bring it gives meaning my uncle bring sweets but my uncle will my uncle will do you do you get anything actually no it doesn't have a complete sentence so here bring is main verb will act as a helping verb i have seen uti here seen it's an action so it is main verb here have will act as a helping verb so it is auxiliary verb here helping verbs are nothing but auxiliary verb so in all these three sentences here am is auxiliary verb then will is auxiliary verb and in third sentence have is auxiliary verb so it needs helping verb may sorry it needs main verb to give a complete meaning and next actually what i want to explain you is kinds of auxiliary verbs so we have seen 
two kinds of verbs that is more uh, help main verb and auxiliary verb in auxiliary verb we have two kinds one is primary auxiliary verbs and modal auxiliary verbs so let me explain you what is primary auxiliary verbs so primary auxiliary verbs are those which function as both main and helping for example there are three kinds of primary auxiliary verbs they are be form have form and do form so primary auxiliary verbs will act as main and helping what does it mean by main and helping can you see here be that is main verb actually main auxiliary verb have is also main auxiliary verb do is also main auxiliary verb so be have do this three will act as a main auxiliary verbs pri pri primary auxiliary verbs that is called actually main auxiliary verbs so here other than actually be form am is was are where will be used as helping verbs here in the have form we can see have had has so had and has will be act as helping verbs do did does so here did and does will act as a helping verb so i can explain you with example how to differentiate main and helping auxiliary verbs so let me explain you i will do it so in this sentence you can see will is also auxiliary verb do also auxiliary verb so let me tell you which is primary auxiliary verb and which is uh, helping which is which is main and which is helping here so will will come under modal auxiliary verb that i'll tell you later in the next in the next uh, uh, slide so will comes under modal auxiliary verb here do will act as a main auxiliary verb because you can see here do form will come under be have do the three will come under main auxiliary verb so uh, always there will be only one main verb and one helping verb next to a main verb can i uh, write it as actually i will did it i will does it no it won't come it won't suit i will do it so along with the main verb there is a helping auxiliary verb this will will come under modal auxiliary verb so in the next sentence i will be cooking so here will is modal auxiliary verb be comes under be form of verbs this is main aux main form of auxiliary verb so i will do it sorry i will be cooking so can i Uh, here with the main uh, this is a already known it's a helping verb and b is acting as a main verb can i use i is be cooking i was be cooking i are be cooking i were be cooking no i will be cooking so next to um, uh, what is that call helping verb one more main auxiliary verb should come actually so this act as a helping verb here and this act as a main verb here they will have reached here by monday so in this sentence here reached will act as what reached is acting as a main verb here actually here you can see we have will have so will will act as a uh, uh, help may uh, helping verb and have will act as a main auxiliary verb and this will act as a helping auxiliary verb so in this sentence we reached as a main verb and will will act as a will will act as a helping auxiliary verb have will act as a auxiliary uh, main auxiliary verb so finally so here it is understood that when in a sentence be have do comes next to a uh, what is it called actually helping verb then it is a main main auxiliary verbs so here will is act as a helping auxiliary verb and then in next 
let's move to the next slide model auxiliary verb model auxiliary verbs are helping verbs they are will would can could shall should may might must so it's it's see here you can see example we must pay tax here pay is action it is acting as a main verb here must is work acting as a model auxiliary verb shall we play game so play will act as what is it called a main verb shall is here model auxiliary verb uncle will bring sweets here bring will act as a main verb and here will will act as a helping verb that is nothing but model auxiliary verb so hope you all would have got it actually if you have any doubts kindly let me know in the before comment section so that i can clear your doubts thank you so much for listening take care be safe bye bye